Hi, this video is to demo the Xbox Series X being used with the Vitur One Air glasses uh, through its Vitur mobile dock, uh, which allows you to use HDMI devices such as the Series X, PS5, pretty much any HDMI device in addition to dual glasses if you have two Vitur Ones. Uh, we don't have an extra pair, but we can demo the Xbox Series X today. So this is connected in, on my entertainment system. Uh, it is going through wireless Picto 60 gigahertz MM wave device, which is a zero lag uh, wireless HDMI dongle. And that transmitter is going to the Picto HDMI receiver. And this HDMI receiver, you can see the HDMI out, it is going to the Vitter dock. And the power for this receiver is actually connected to the side of my recliner since it has a USB port for power. Um, but you can see here that HDMI port from the Picto receiver goes straight into the Vitur dock. You can see here it has its own battery, it's fully charged. It's got two glasses ports, uh, one I'm connected to. And this one's for like the a switch or any USB-C device if you want to connect here. I think this mainly switch, I've tried. Um, well, no, you can actually connect the dock to this in RG Alley. Um, or the deck, I mean, in RG Alley. This is the HDMI cable where you can plug in your HDMI devices. This is going to the HDMI receiver. And if you remember, the HDMI receiver is connected to my transmitter, and the transmitter is connected to my Xbox Series X. So um, you can see here in the glasses that I have uh, Killer Instinct playing. And, uh, yep, this is uh, Killer Instinct on Xbox Series X. There is zero lag, looks great. And there's no issues with the image. Uh, no drops, frame drops or anything. This is basically like being wired directly in through this Picto device. But, uh, yeah, it's a little difficult to capture this. I wish I had a a little stand to hold my phone in the glasses, but you can see here um, everything is working great. I'll be testing other consoles. I have uh, PS3, 360, Wii, um, PS4, and um, other devices as well, uh, such as uh, classic consoles, Genesis Mini, SNS Classic, and stuff like that. So uh, stay tuned. Thanks.